Hey, today I'm going to show you how to use the outline effect in your text to really make your words pop where you need them to and to get better use out of the fonts that you're already using. So let me just show you how to do that in Canva. So I have a document open here and I've got some different text here. And so this is a font that I've added and it does not have like a bold option. You can see that the bold is um, like grayed out here. So it means I'm not able to make that bold. So, but I wanna make it a little bit thicker. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on the font that I'm gonna do that to, and I'm gonna go to effects that's up here on the top. And then you'll see all these different options, but we're gonna go to outline. And I'm gonna click on outline and you can see it puts an automatic color around, but we wanna pick the same color that the main font is in. So I can figure out what that is by going up here to the top, go to this A, and then I can see it's right here. It's actually the one in my brand um, kit here. So I'm gonna click on that, make sure that's what it is. And then I'm gonna go back to effects. I'm gonna click on this gray box and I'm gonna go change it to that black again. And you can see that it made the font a lot thicker. And it can go quite a bit thicker here um, but I just want to keep it just a little bit thicker than it was. I don't want the words touching or getting too close to touching. Okay, there. All right, then I can do the same thing here. I'm going to go make sure I know what color it is. It's this blue one here. I'm going to go to effects and outline, and then I'm going to change that to the blue, and then I can play around with the thickness right there. Another great place to use this if it's used really carefully is with a script font. So sometimes a script font will just be a little bit too thin in some places. And if you go here, go to effects, and again, we're going to do the outline and change it to the color we're using already. Uh, and then really, you're just going to want barely any thickness on it, just like that. All right, here is a PDF that we're creating. This is in my brand in a box collection. Let's say as you're using it, you want to thicken up this script here. If you go to effects, go, let's just make sure we know what color it is. Okay, it's the second black one here. Go to effects, go to outline, and then get the thickness just right. Okay, now that you've done it to one of them, you can come up here, copy the style, and paste it. Then you don't have to go get the settings um, just every single time like that. So let's copy it and paste it. All right, so that is how you can change your thickness in your fonts so that you're able to make your designs really pop. All right, we'll see you next time.